It's Monday, October 23rd. You're listening to Your Florida Daily. I'm Katrina Scales. Today, the City of Orlando commissioners are expected to vote on a deal to purchase Pulse Nightclub. Mayor Buddy Dyer says the decision comes after years of trying to figure out the future of the property, adding that several family members of victims of the 2016 nightclub mass shooting have been waiting for a proper memorial for their loved ones. The sale price is listed at $2 million, well under what the city first offered several years ago. However, owner Barbara Palma declined that offer and instead continued fundraising for her organization called the One Pulse Foundation. While the purchase will likely get approved, the mayor says there's still no official plans for a memorial. It became clear um, in the last several months that the Pulmas and One Pulse were not going to be able to come to an agreement related to the Pulse property and building the memorial for Pulse on that property. Pulma did not want to comment on camera, but did release a statement saying they are grateful for the mayor and the city commission for, quote, making this a reality. Today's vote is set for two o'clock. We now know Florida lawmakers will convene a special session two weeks from today, and Israel will be top of mind. Lawmakers are expected to not only formally express support for Israel, but also to impose additional sanctions against Iran and add security to protect Jewish institutions in the state. The session is also expected to take up several other issues, including relief following Hurricane Adalia and the current backlog and applications for the My Safe Florida Home program. And some good news when it comes to the pain at the pump. The cost of gas continues to go down, leading to the lowest gas prices in seven months. According to new numbers from AAA, the average for a gallon of regular in Florida is 3.23. That's down 10 cents from last week and 41 cents from a month ago. However, several stations are advertising prices under $3 a gallon. Experts say this is due to lower demand and refineries switching to a cheaper winter blend of gasoline. The national average for regular is 3.55 a gallon. Find these top stories along with breaking news, weather, and traffic all day on ClickOrlando.com. And now, a completely random Florida fact. You've heard about dumping tea in Boston Harbor, but what about dumping alcohol in the Atlantic Ocean? Well, it happened in Miami in the summer of 1927. Prohibition enforcers carried out the display to show they were serious about the nation's ban on alcohol. It's believed $250,000 of rum, champagne, whiskey, and other spirits all ended up in the water. Prohibition would officially end six years later. Your Florida Daily is produced by News 6 WKMG in Orlando. I'm Katrina Scales. Subscribe for new episodes wherever you like to listen.